right, let's talk about a couple of things today, people. First, let's talk about uh, let, let, let's talk about inflation and how I run two businesses and, and work Uber Eats, and I'm not gonna say I'm struggling, but I'm doing as good as I should be doing if I had a normal job. Let's talk about that. So, okay, that ain't coach either. Let me just talk about my expenses. I have two children and I got a wife. Yeah. Them motherfuckers cost a lot. So, our monthly bills are anywhere from like four to 5,000. Now, is that extra? It kinda is, it really kinda is. Um, rent is 1,800. Business insurance is 95. Workers comp like 95 a month car insurance for both of my cars is 350 we got a phone and internet that's another let's just add 150 got gas gas is stupid bro like plus i have a problem with my car right now and it's it's not running as many miles per gallon as it should so bro like i got like 25 miles per gallon when i really should have like 36 so, I'm getting smacked on that. I'm, oh, I'm at least spending 400 on gas a month. At least. That very least. Um, then I got payroll. That's dropped a lot because I've lost two contracts. But then I got payroll, which is another 1400 um, And now I'm going to only be making $6,700 a month. So, I, and then after, so, after I pay payroll and after bills, that's, I think it's going to be 67. I, I still got to do projections. But this check coming up is about to be 7,800. But I got to pay the last people who were working for me the rest of their shit because I couldn't pay them right after. So I, I literally had to pay them their payroll. And then a week went past. And then I had to fire them, like three people, because of a situation that happened while I was on vacation. Why did I lose two contracts? Long story short. So overall, it's it's a little bit of a messed up situation where I'm gonna be making a lot less money. I'm going from eleven thousand five hundred a month to sixty. What what what's gonna be sixty seven hundred dollars a month? Um, now also my payroll is going from like seven thousand dollars a month to like fifteen hundred dollars a month, which is really good. It's really good. And then I actually I'm gonna be real. This is actually a good thing. I'm a lot less stressed now. I get to be at the gym. Like, I'm at the gym right now, but they uh, they close until 10. So that's why I just decided to make this video. I'm going to just be sitting here kicking it for the next probably 30 minutes. <laughs> There's about three other people out here with me just kicking it. But, shit, um, yeah, yeah, inflation is just crazy. Um, then I seen something on TV where it said Camilla Harris. I think that's her name. The vice president of the United States is to blame for the gas prices. Now, I could be putting my foot in my mouth right now, but doesn't the president and Congress have something to do with that? Like, isn't Joe Biden the one who said, let's put this in place and whatever they put in place on that side made the gas prices higher? Like, I don't know if they just spent more money on oil, whatever, I don't, I don't know all the intricacies of it, but they did something over here that made gas crazy. Um, so I don't think Camilla Harris did that. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure Joe Biden did that. And yeah, but maybe they just want to uh, blame Democrats. I don't vote myself. Um, I'm not a Democrat. I'm not a Republican. I'm just nothing. I, I don't vote. I don't think I'm old enough to understand everything to have a good vote. And I don't too much care about that stuff right now. And I think my vote would maybe do more wrong than right. I just never got into it. It just doesn't interest me. Maybe when I'm older. I mean, I'm, I'm 24. So maybe when I'm like, shoot, 30. Or maybe even when I'm like 28, I actually care about, um, I actually care about voting. But as of right now, I'm, I'm not on that. Uh, let me give you all an update about the glitch boxing stuff. 
I've been doing the course and it is making my, uh, it's making me faster. It definitely is. I'm able to snap them punches very quick. Um, I definitely see my hand speed has went up exponentially. I did sparring for the last two weeks because uh, I missed one week because I was out. So I've done three total sparrings. Um, and I like what I'm seeing. I like what I'm seeing. What I do realize... I, what I do realize is I, uh, did somebody open up the door? Yep. Okay. All right. Bet, bet, bet. All right. I'm going to go up there right now.